Hi, welcome to the introduction of AlgoDocs. With AlgoDocs, you can easily convert your documents into the structured data with no coding at all. You can extract data with high accuracy from virtually any document. So let's begin. You can use File Manager to upload your documents manually by right-clicking on any folder. You can create more folders and subfolders and keep your uploaded documents organized. Convert PDF or Image to Editable Files option can be used for simply converting your PDFs or images into Microsoft Word, Excel, text, and other editable files. This option converts your documents by preserving the original layout of your documents. For extracting specific fields or tables from your documents and getting structured data as a result, you need to select Upload Files for Data Extraction option. This option requires an extractor to be created before you can upload your files. Therefore, the first step is to create an extractor and only then we can upload our files for extracting data from them. Let us create the extractor. As an example, we will create the extractor for extracting data from this sample file with patient information. I will name it patient information and upload our sample file. Assume that we would like to extract only the name, surname and date of birth fields from our documents. We will begin by adding a field for the name. AlgoDocs provides two approaches for extracting data from your documents, which are AI-based data extraction and rule-based data extraction. Name field, let us select form data extraction method, which captures all key value pairs in our documents and lets us keep the ones we need. We click on continue button. Here, we can see all key value pairs that are captured from our document. If we need all captured key value pairs, we don't need to apply any filters, which would produce a table output with two columns key and a value. However, since we want to get a single field, then we can add keep rows filter where column one contains first name. Further, we remove the key column. Lastly, we convert the result to text and save the field. We are done with the name field. For surname field, we can duplicate the name field. Since the filters we applied for the name field are going to be very similar to the filters in the surname field. It is enough for us to change the first name keyword to last name. That's it. Now, let us create the date of birth field, but this time using rule-based method. This makes our extractor to be hybrid, such that an extractor that has a mixture of methods for data extraction. In filter section, we have two default filters already added which we can use to capture the date of birth field. We also can remove trailing blank spaces and save the field. In Extracted Data section, we can view extracted data from our documents. Here we can filter by the extractor, folder, and range of dates. As we can see, all three fields are extracted properly for the sample file we uploaded when creating the extractor. Since our extractor is ready, we can upload hundreds and thousands of documents. We can use integrations for automatically importing documents to AlgoDocs, such as email, Google Drive, or hundreds of other integrations using Zapier. However, we will upload our files manually using File Manager. Note that, the sample file we uploaded when creating the extractor is stored under the root folder by default. Let us create a new folder and name it Patient Information Sheets. We right-click on the created folder and upload two more files that we have. Processing time depends on the number of pages in case your documents are PDFs. Single scanned PDF page, 
or an image takes around 8 seconds to process. As you can see, newly uploaded files are also processed and the data is extracted accurately. You can reprocess your files free of charge after making changes to your extractor. For example, let us add another field to the extractor, a phone number. When we come back to Extracted Data section, we can see that only the first file has extracted data for the phone field, because this file is used as a sample document with the extractor. Therefore, we can reprocess all files and get the phone field extracted for remaining files too. After refreshing the table, we can see that phone field is also populated with extracted phone numbers as expected. Again, Keep in mind that reprocessing of your files does not cost you anything, so you may reprocess your files as many times as needed. You can export extracted data manually to Excel, JSON, or XML. In addition, you can fetch extracted data using webhooks, a PI, or hundreds of other integrations using Zapier. For any questions and support, please contact support at algodocs.com. Thank you for watching.